Hey, everybody. Another POP trends here. I'm going to be ranting about something, and I'm actually be ranting about a rant I did and a reaction to it. But first off, thank you all for listening to all my podcasts throughout the year. I appreciate that for this last week going into Christmas. There will be no Pat Oates podcast or Pat Oates show or Podophiles. Next week, we'll record some. I've just been busy with my other radio job. I've been doing a lot of fill-in stuff as a part-time guy. So if you want to hear me at all, you can go to 99.1 WPLR or 95.9 The Fox and find out what days I'm on there and listen to me on regular radio where you don't get to swear but still have this lovely voice. If you're watching this at all, please subscribe on YouTube. I appreciate when you subscribe on YouTube. It helps me know that people are watching. Just go to the Pato's YouTube channel and subscribe to that. If you like the Podophiles podcast, go over to the Podophiles YouTube channel. If you really love what I do and you want to get all this content, and believe me, a ton more is coming in 2021. A lot of good plans for that. Coming to the Patreon. So go to the Pat Oates Podcast Patreon. We got some new subscribers. Thank you, Ezra, who just signed up. And um, got a lot more great things coming up, so please listen to that. My last POP trend rant was about the stimulus check and me bitching about bitching which was quoted wonderfully by doug of the who's right podcast thank you guys for the shout out and uh paying attention to what i do love you guys you know that if my audio wasn't always terrible i get to be a guest on your show sometime but anyway back to what i was saying i was bitching about people that are complaining about the money it's not enough and i was saying i'm poor i want whatever money i'm just happy to get money people should just be happy but I think people misconstrued what I was talking about. I wasn't saying that I don't think we deserve more. I wasn't saying that people shouldn't get more money. I'm not that 600 is enough. What I was saying was if I'm given the choice of $600 or no dollars, I would love $600. A lot of people are complaining and saying, well, I guess I can't use this. I don't want this. And that's what I was bitching about. The people that aren't just happy that they're getting something. Because I need something. I don't need nothing. I need something. Now, if they said, take 600 now, or let's protest and fight, and then we'll get 1,500, or we'll get 1,000 every week, like some people have said, then yeah, okay, then I guess I won't take the 600. I would like the 600. I could use it to pay bills. That's what I was complaining about. The people that just bitch without real reasons to bitch. They're just going, I don't like this. I hate all politicians. Okay, I get it. That's the thing. You hate them all. I don't give a fuck about politicians. I don't care about politics. I care about paying my bills. I have not been able to work, like I've said before, because comedy got taken away. That a lot of my other gigs got taken away. So I had to take a part-time job and work like a real essential dork now. And it's a struggle. It's a big struggle to try to catch up and do everything. So if I got handed 600 bucks, I'm not excited about it, but I'm in the moment. I'm talking about what's happening right now. In this moment, I can use $600. And if that's what the government feels like they're going to give me, then I'm fucking taking it, baby. But do I wish we can get more? Does it make sense to get more? Do we need more than that? Of course we do. 600 doesn't help your life. One time 1,200, one time 600. That's not what I was saying. What I was saying is stop fucking bitching unless you have a plan or a reason. Don't just bitch to bitch. That part sucks. If you just complain about things without, but they should take away your social media. When you just complain, have, they should, when you complain or go, wow, I hate this guy or Pat's voice sounds like Seth Rogen on crack. At least that's an example. Maybe you don't like Seth Rogen on crack. Then I can justify that and say you're fine. But you just yell to yell. You should be asked a question. What do you mean by that? And if you can't answer it, we take away your social media. If you can't answer it twice, I get your $600. So that's what I was talking about, Doug. That's what I was saying there was just that I don't think that it's enough. But if we're going to get anything at all, I'm not going to complain. And I'm going to use it to pay my bills. Some of you are going to use it to buy a PS5. Some are going to use it to buy a gun to defend yourself from people that are all mad about everything. Whatever you're going to do with it, you do with it. Uh, Yeah, I wish it was more. I wish a lot of things were more. I wish I had more hair. I wish I had more love. I wish I was taller, a little bit of a baller, whatever that fucking song is. I don't care. What I'm saying is this. Let's all just stop bitching. 2021, we've been through hell in 2020. Stop complaining for the sake of complaining. If you have a real take on it, which some people do, I'd like to see your take on it. I'd love to read it on Twitter or Facebook or Instagram, whatever, and see your video and see you talking about why 600 isn't enough and what and what your solution is. Because I don't know what happens. I just think that they hit a button and they make money. That's not the case. It's got to come from somewhere or they would just do that. But the simple fact is 
I'll take the 600. I'm poor. I'd like it. And if you don't want your 600, my Venmo is Pat at Pat dash Oats. Send your 600 to me. Thank you for listening. Happy whatever the heck you celebrate.